this is question number 4d here you can see in this figure okay in this figure this front part okay this front part i have drawn here okay this is called area of cross section this is in the book you can see this is colored part okay this is the colored part i will share here okay this part okay this part okay this side okay you can see here same figure is here okay this all part is called area of cross section okay so we have to find the area of cross section so cross sectional area there is given calculate the cross sectional area from this prism so cross sectional area will be what you can see here uh, this is our 3 this is 2 this is 3 and here you can see this is 3 means this is 3 ok so this is also 3 this is also our 3 cm ok and this is 3 cm so this is also 3 cm this is 3 so this is also 3 and this is 2 cm so this is also 2 cm ok and this is 2 cm so this is also 2 cm ok and this is 3 cm so this is 3 cm and we got this this and this this is 2 cm so this is 2 cm ok this is given already 2 cm 2 cm 2 cm 3 cm 3 3 and this is 3 so this is 3 and this is a 2 so this is a 2 ok this is also 2 cm ok this is also 2 cm ok this is also 2 cm and this is 2 cm given here 3 cm ok now cross sectional area to find the cross sectional area what I will do I will I will join okay I will join this way this and this okay so this this I will find this is now 3 cm 3 cm this is a square so this is a square area is how much 3 into 3 L into B 3 into 3 plus and now this rectangle this rectangle what is this rectangle length is how much is here this is 2 cm this is 2 cm and this is total is 3 so this is 3 so 2 plus 3 is how much 2 3 5 and this is 2 so 7 this is 7 into this is length okay 7 is length 2 plus this 3 okay this is 3 from here 2 plus this is 3 why because this is 3 so this is 3 2 plus 3 5 and 5 and this is 2 so 5 to 7 and into this is the length this is the length and this is the breadth 2 cm this is okay, 2 cm so 2 cm plus in the same down part this is 3 cm 3 cm 3 cm so this is also 3 cm so this is a square that means 3 into 3 now here you can see this is 3 to 9 plus 7 to 14 plus 3 is 9 so 9 9 18 19 20 32 this is 9 9 18 32 okay so this is 32 cm square in the book answer is given okay 32 cm okay correct now second is there to find what the lateral surface area of this okay this figure so lateral surface area means not this front part okay this this is area of cross section not area this and not that side okay from this side okay from the left side or from the right side whatever part we see okay that is called lateral surface area so for the lateral surface area formula is perimeter of cross section into length so what is perimeter of cross section perimeter of cross section is here this is the cross section okay area of cross section this is perimeter this is the cross section part perimeter means what we have to start okay i'll start from here from this point okay so this to this is how much 2 cm plus the 2 and then okay this is 2 cm from here to here is how much uh, 2 cm plus again now from here to here this is 3 from here to now here 3 and now from here to here is 3 and now from here to here is this is 2 and from here to here is this is 2 and from here to here is how much? 2 and then here to here is 3 and here to here is 3 
here to here okay now here to here three and here to here is almost two okay this is the perimeter of this uh, cross section now length so length we have to take this length okay thickness this is 5 cm thickness okay so length take this 5 cm here length and this length will take in the volume what as a height this is the height okay in the volume case and length is here 5 okay so I'll write here into 5 so total is how much uh, 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, okay, correct. 2, 2, 4, 4, 3, 7, 10, 15, 15, 19, 90, 20, 22, 25, 25, and this 30 into 5. This is 30 into 5, okay. So 5, these are 15, this is 150 cm squares. Okay, this is correct, 150 cm squares is correct. Now total surface area we have to find. So here, what is total surface area? The total surface area formula is what? Lateral surface area into 2 plus area of cross section. So lateral surface area means we we'll have already calculated here 150. So 150 plus 2 area of cross section. 2 times this area of cross section we have calculated here 32. So this is equal to 150 plus. 2 to the 4 and 3 to the 6, 64. Here is 150 and 60. 150 and 64. So this is how much? 50, 50, 100, and there is even 40. 214 cm square, okay? 214 correct, okay? This is 214 is correct. Now, Volume area of the cross section into height. Okay, this is the formula for the volume area of cross section into height. So, what is the cross section area? It is 32. And height, I already told you in the case of lateral surface area, we take length and length is 5 cm. So, same this 5 is here height. Okay, this thickness we have taken volume 5. So, 32 into 5, 5 to the 10, 0, carry 1, 5 to the 15, 16, 160. This is volume, so cm cube. 160 is correct okay so dear this is the solution of the number okay i tapa have like my video my formula or okay formula to try or you should know a lot you talk video boys no one you're funny boys no one shall love it at it a 150 area then i do 150 cm square shall love Video like Matthew topic on here is and the Matthew topic is already sending a can exercise 6.1 way to open your topic with the principal words with a real life of a computer.